how's it going? Dr. Incompetent here, and, well, let's play some Minecraft, shall we? Oh my, there's skeletons, there's all kinds of bad stuff. It's not safe, people. So, in light of it being safe, what we need to do is continue our project. Now, with this project, um, I noticed I did put a torch here, I'm gonna have to get that. I like to do something, and it might just be foolish, I don't know, but the way I enjoy doing my staircase down in my first area is to try to make it a bit of a grand affair. And this might not last forever, but um, I do like to make it where it's three wide just to kind of make it a nice staircase you can go up and down it on a horse or something like that now i was lucky enough that i was reading everyone's comments on my first video here after my long hiatus and you have helped me tremendously I used some of the shortcuts that you guys were telling me about with holding down left click and holding down right click when using the crafting table, making things like distributing items around. So what I'm understanding is that there's been a lot of quality of life improvements to Minecraft, and that's just only natural when a game has existed for this long and with this many people playing it. Um, you're going to improve upon things. The game will evolve. And people are going to, you know, expect refinements like that. So they're all new to me. And because I haven't been playing, I don't know any of them. So learning them from you guys is just phenomenal. All right. So let me pretend like I can do this the right way. So, oh, it's a beautiful day outside. Look at that. What an amazing day. Oh my god, there's still a, a skeleton who wants to shoot me. Um, and, okay. I'm going to have to let him burn out there while he does that. Alright, I'm going to go into my um, inventory. And, you know what? I'm going to do something really fast. I'm going to go to options, and I'm going to go to controls. And I'm going to say inventory. Um, be -be -be -be. Uh, what is this Q? Drop selected item. Right, right, right. Um, no, 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 no. Go to inventory. Uh, let's see. Oh, there's a sprint. Holy smokes, that's new to me. Um, okay. Uh, yeah, this is the one where I'm going to just change this to I. And I'm going to do that because I keep pushing I for inventory instead of E, and it's just throwing me off. All right, so I'm going to go to my crafting table. And so this is the thing where if I hold down Shift, um, I can distribute these equally like this. And so I want to make like, you know, as many staircases as I can. I'm going to just add these uh, to the piles if I can. There. And then just do this. So if I shift left click it, I make all of them. Great. So I need these staircases, as you can tell. So that I can... Um, Is it really just a stack of 40? Oh, no, I can do 64. Yeah, that's right. Begin my descent. All right, so this used to always crush me as I would try to make sure that I didn't get them facing, like, the wrong way. Now, the reason I like to build staircases, I know it's perhaps unnecessary, but I love how smooth the movement is um, when you're on a staircase. I just can't get enough of it. I probably didn't need to do that, but it happened. 
All right, so do I want to make, like, how far down do I want to go before I start looking around? You know what I mean? Uh-huh. And just exploring. Maybe I should just dig until uh, I venture into another kind of cavern or something. I don't know. Anyway... Now that we've got a little bit more space, we can continue our game. And see, so if I have all of these steps like this, I can just run a... Oh, no. It used to be way smoother. It was like... It used to be silky smooth when I would go up and down steps. It wasn't like this horrifying, jagged experience. I wonder if I'm doing something wrong. Well, anyway, maybe they wanted to... I mean, it used to be like you were on a ramp, and I loved it. I loved how smooth it was, but now it's all bumpy. Maybe I need to... Is my character's, like, head bob on or something, and I need to turn that off? Anyway, whatever. What do you guys do? Do you just have bumpy steps, or do you, do you smooth them out? I'm going to chew through this granite. I'm going to get a little bit lower, I think. I still have a lot of steps left. Maybe that's actually a great way to dictate how deep I go with my little um, project here. Is just how many steps I have crafted. And I can just use that arbitrary stopping point. Uh-huh. It's painful, though, digging with this. Oh, boy. Now, I will say, you guys were explaining to me that, like, my experience bar has a two over it. And that I need to, like, have a brewing thing for potions, I guess, or a, an enchanting table. Now, I did build, I think, an enchanting table once before, but I can't remember, and I never used it. Um, so, I've never actually successfully, like, done anything with my experience points in this game. Ah, here's metal jackpot. This is what I'm talking about. This is why I love this strategy. All right, let me just light this up. And then we need to start filling in. Here we go. Okay, so we can just go. Perfect. All right, and then now we can start making ourselves a better pick. But before that, I've got some other work to do with this metal. All right, great. Right, let's get up here. And um, how much coal do I have, actually? I need to put coal in here. Is it in my box? It is. All right, so I'm going to go here. We put the coal in. Or no, like that. And then, uh, can we do this? There we go. Phenomenal. I probably need to build some more ovens. You want to have, like, a bunch of ovens just going off. So. Uh-huh. Like that. And then we can build two. That's pretty good for now. And we'll just have a couple of ovens. Now you will see that I am finally starting to run out of food. <laughs> and so I'm going to need to check on my farm, see how it's going. Somebody was kind enough to explain that irrigation works from four tiles away. So I should be set here eventually with this farm and I can even make it bigger if I have more grass seeds and you know all that stuff but I don't know if I'm going to be able to get food from it in time we'll have to see I was telling my my kids about like how I need to get a bed and I was like well I just gotta shear a sheep 
and they were like, oh no, you can just kill the sheep and get, you know, um, oh, there's an egg. I can eat that. I'm, I'm giving him these seeds, by the way. They were, they were basically just like the parrots and the bats advancement made. I don't know what that means. Um, if, cause I want to make a bed so I can sleep during the night. And like, I guess I always just build shears and just take the, you know, shear the sheep and then get the wool. And they're like, oh no, you can just kill the sheep and get the wool. And, um, just to explain, I usually, I know it's very hard and onerous, especially at the beginning, but I generally don't like to kill animals in this game if I can avoid it. I even don't like to eat them necessarily um, because I find them so endearing looking. These guys love me. Um, I need to build some kind of holding area for them so I can get eggs all day long, right? All right, let's think about that. If I want to get eggs all day long, which I know that I do, how do I make that happen, right? Let me think about that. I don't know if this is the best way to gather seeds either. This might be like the stupidest way, um, but that's what I'm doing for now. All right, so we can just go and start putting down some more wheat. And then, yeah, I always like to make sure that the area around my workspace, like my garden, whatever it might be, has some kind of illumination. So I don't want surprises with skeletons spawning or anything like that. Even this, like this is a little awkward. I might need to um, shore this up with some, I could put dirt and it would probably grow grass again, right? And I need to, let's see. I need to clean this up anyway, so. See, now that's brown. Is that wheat? I can't remember. I don't know how I get... This texture pack, I guess, doesn't have grass. And so I don't know what you guys use if you use a cooler-looking thing for your crops. But whatever. This is fine for now. All right, so now I have some dirt. So let me go into my dirt and use this to uh, try to cover up this area. Yeah, here we go. Just to help so that we don't have any funkiness. There we go. Let me put one on this and then we can put one uh, there. All right, that looks really good. That moon looks incredibly awesome. And let me just kind of go over here. We can put another one there. All right, great. I will put the last torch right there. And now it's time to go inside and just forget any of this ever happened as we safely hide away. And we got some bars. Um, and we got an advancement made. I don't know what these advancements do. Um, if they do anything for you, It, or if they're just for fun. Do they give you rewards if you complete any of the advancements? This is all new to me as well. Are they just like in-game achievements or something? Little quests? Is it some kind of like questing system that they built into the game just to give some guidance? Or is there real purpose to doing it? Like, is this a priority I should make, or is it meh? All right. No, I can't do anything there. 
Um, no, that doesn't do anything either. Uh, can I just eat that, like, on its own? I'll have to find out. <laughs> I'm going to put in some of uh, well, these can stack. Put away some granite. We really don't need that much of it right now. And this stuff can go in there as well. Okay, great. So I'm going to just make some more torches. I'm kind of running out. Actually, yeah, just make everything into sticks. And then we can put that back. And then from here, we can just say, can we make a better pickaxe, like an iron pickaxe? Yeah. So if we click this, um, we can certainly make one. Okay, that's nice. Then if I want to make um, anything else, do we have the... Do I just have to know? All right, it used to be that you could make scissors yeah here we go shears i need shears pretty badly and i don't think i have enough for a bucket do i oh no i do great perfect so those are two like utilities that i want um all right we got an iron pick and now i just use this i know i shouldn't i should save it i just use it for speed because now I can mine through things a little faster. Now, whenever I find metal, I get excited and just start to mine everything around it, thinking that it will be there. But you never, I mean, it's, you know, not really an indication of that at all. I just want to look. I want to see. All right. And it was not an indication, even remotely. But here's something we have to do which is we need to go here and um, I will take this coal. Why not? It's worth it. Okay, great. And we can dig through this just to make sure we see everything over here. And there's no surprises. Perfect. Okay. We can even dig around the corner. Why not? There. That's fun. Okay. Now, um, I need to make some torches. A lantern, a campfire. Wow, that seems really cool. Yeah, an oak fence gate. A lever, pressure plate. Well, I don't need a pressure plate, but um, anyway, do this and this, and then just make a bunch of torches. And that's good. We've got a bunch of torches. All right. So now we can go back down into our little hole and just put torches so that we don't encounter any difficulty from aggressive enemies and keep digging. Mm -hmm. Just make some progress on our staircase while the nighttime does its thing. All right, great. So now, just start working in these steps. Oh my, see, that's a failed step right there. There we go. All right, is it daytime yet? No. That guy was like, oh no, it's not daytime. Here I am. All right, fine. Be there. Do exactly what you're doing. 
All right, let's just dig a little bit here. I'm always just seeing if I can get lucky, seeing if I can find some metal. We're losing a lot of ground by not getting more metal and me using this pick. Um, but I'm greedy. I like to just have the faster pick going. Oh, there we go. There's some metal. That's terrific. All right, let's see if we get any more. Oh, here's some. Yes. Oh. It's this. Oh. Treasure trove here. All right, perfect. Let's pick all this stuff up. And we can just look around. It doesn't look like there's going to be anything else here, but I always just check anyway. Clicking on every single thing. Some random samplings. Nope. Okay, perfect. And then I'm going to seal this up. This is like, you know, Egyptian pharaoh stuff, but it's nice because then you just guarantee that there won't be any funny business from behind there. All right, here we go. And boom, let's get out. Let's start burning these up. All right, so we got some metal. Let's put it in there and get some more bars. Um, not quite daytime, but really, really close. All right, let's just dump some stuff into our box. So uh, we can put this... Oop, not that, but... That's pretty good. Mm -hmm. I can hear him going. The sun is coming up. He's burning away. Um, yep, yeah, you're up here. Oh, okay. Somebody was telling me that I need to... Oh, boy, they're under the shade of that tree. Yeah, that's a shame. Uh, we've lured them out, so they're going to slowly and horribly die. You jerk. Aw, oh, man. No, they're not gonna die, huh? Oh, boy. Almost killed. We got it. Oof. That was brutal. Alright. And there's that guy's still up there. That's upsetting. Um, oh god! All right, let's see. Did we get these done? Okay, we did. All right. So, um, you know, I can make boots, legs, a helmet, something like that. Plus five, plus two, plus two. Uh, maybe I should make some pants. You know, an iron sword would probably be six attack damage, 1.6 attack speed versus, well, the stone sword is actually not that much better. Yep, I'll take the pants. There we go. Um, I was under the impression that you healed if you had food. Is it only if you're at full health that you heal your your energy? I mean, full food or whatever? It's awful. Um, can I eat this then? Oh my god, I just threw it. I thought right click would... Oh my, that did not work. So right click doesn't eat, huh? I'm ruined. Alright, we're going out. I'm just going to get killed by this guy. I know it, but I have to go check on my farm. So first things first, we got to get rid of that tree so that nobody can spawn under it. This tree also needs to be finished, so we can do that. If I chop this... Oh no, there's still more up there. I need wood. 
so that's cool, but um, I need to get to, to that thing. So I'm going to just have to put down, um, I'm going to have to put down some wood really fast so I can get rid of that. Now, this tree should, should, I say should because I'm not 100% sure, um, despawn at this point. Oh, there's a bunch of coal. I need that anyway. And let's finish this tree. And if this dude is out there, if that skeleton archer man is still here, then ouch is all I can say. Oh, it's like a pine tree, maybe? All right, got it. Great. Okay. Oh, we got some zombie flesh and things like this. Um, I think I can milk the cow with the bucket. I got milk now. Um, let me go to options, controls. Um, use item or place block as right button so i don't know how to like use food i think if i if i could drink the milk oh no i could i drank it i don't know if it did anything for me but no it doesn't really do much at all does it like i drank it but i didn't get any new nutrients back at all that's miserable, but we did get milk. Okay, so let me go to my inventory and put my shears on. And try to find some sheep. Oh, I got an apple. Apple is great. Here we go, here's some animals. Here's the chickens from before. Oh, they have an egg for me, too. Oh, no, I fell. Come back here, sheep. I'm trying to make a bed, dude. Got him. Boom. We got some wool from that dude, for sure. All right, great. Anybody else? Here's some pigs. Um, I'm not going to butcher you unless... I starve to death, but I don't think I will. Oh, here's a brown sheep. Sweet. Got it. All right. So I'm running, I guess. I'm sprinting. Oh, here's another sheep. Hello. Thank you. Oh, here's all kinds of animals. Chickens abound. Wool. Wool. This is a joyous day. All right, great. Now let me go back to my... Oh, my. Look, there's like some black horses. Sweet. And my tower stands strong. Everyone can see it from miles away to direct us home. All right, let's get a little bit of coal. All right, so one other thing is I'm gonna, I think you can eat this zombie flesh. It might poison me, but I think like maybe if I cook it, it's not as bad, I don't know. None of my stuff is tall enough to be turned into wheat, though. It doesn't look like. Let's close that. And then, can we burn this up? Not really. All right, that's a shame. But we did get some wool. Um... White wool, nine. Okay. So to make a bed, it takes what? Uh, I 
It just takes three wood planks. Perfect. Yep, let's make this white bed and just put it um, here for now. And we can set this out. So now we can, you know, have a little place to sleep. That's great. All right. Um, if I sleep in this, you can only sleep at night or during thunderstorms. Oh, okay. Interesting. Um, what about if I eat this apple? Like, what does this do for me? It helps me a little bit. It helps me a little bit. But it's going to take more than just that to make this happen. So I wonder if you can grow apple trees. Anyway. Everyone, we got metal. And we got a bed. And things are going great so far. I want to say... Thank you so much for watching this Let's Play Minecraft. I hope you have an excellent evening or day, and I will check you guys next time when we continue our quest of exploration and really just establishing our base camp for now. All right, everybody. Take care.